Hi, my name is Brooke. I'm a stylist here at Michaels. I've worked here for about four years, and today I'm gonna to be showing you how to curl your hair with the flat iron. The products I'm gonna be using today are the Michaels Styling Cream, the Michaels Stay, the Michaels Designer Shaping Hairspray, and the Michaels Texture Taffy. So to start out, you are either going to want to wash your hair and start out with the styling cream before you blow dry. Just helps you give a little bit of hold to your hair, um, a little bit of control. It's sometimes better to do it on hair that's not freshly washed. Um, it just helps kind of give you a little bit of control over it so it's not so fly away. So to start out, I'm gonna use the Michael Stay. Um, it's a humidity resistant thermal styling spray. I just mist it in all over, and then I'm gonna go back through and comb it so it's not tangly at all. You're gonna to want to use a flat iron that's about an inch um, wide. You can use a little bit bigger, a little bit smaller. You're just gonna get either a smaller curl or a looser curl. This is about an inch and a half. So I'm gonna start out by sectioning off one side. You can take a little bit bigger sections. This isn't supposed to be a perfect curl. It's more of just kind of a fun, messy curl. So you're going to take your flat iron in vertically. You're going to start at your root. You're going to turn it about three-fourths the way around and just pull through your end. And it's going to be a little tighter at first. So at the end, I'm going to go back through with the Michael's Texture Taffy and kind of pull it out just a little bit. And again, I'm going to start at the root, rotate it, and pull it all the way to the end. If you get pieces that aren't too perfect, don't worry about them yet. You can always go back at the end to kind of fix whatever pieces you need to. I'm going to start on the next section now. And as you can see, it's a pretty wide section. It's nothing too small. You can kind of twist the curl how you want it. Now if you take too big a section, it's just gonna be a little bit looser. Your end might stick out kind of funny. You can always, if you take too big of a section, just go back in and fix whatever you need to. And with my bangs, I just like to do them a little bit looser. I don't like anything too tight around my face. So I'm just gonna go in and kind of create a little bit of just a wave in my bang. I'm gonna start on the other side, just same sectioning. And for the back, I'm not really too perfect with it. Um, I try to pull some of the sections more around to the front so you're not trying to work so far behind your head. So I'm just gonna pull these kind of around. So once you've gone through it all, you can kind of check back and see if there's any pieces that you need to touch up. Anything funny or laying how you don't like it. Just go back in. And recurl it. Now I'm going to use the Michaels Texture Taffy. This is just going to kind of help loosen the curl a little bit, give a little bit of separation and texture. 
you don't need a whole lot. I just kind of dip a little bit of a finger in, maybe like a dime size, emulsify it in both hands, and just kind of run it through. And don't get discouraged. This is not the easiest thing to try on yourself at first, but the messy look is in, so don't, don't give up. Now I'm gonna go in with the Michaels Designer Shaping Spray. And this is a good working spray. It's not so stiff. You can kind of, you know, move your hair around. And that's it.